so vector arts and animations are the future so in this video we'll be talking about how you can convert yourself into a cartoon it's more like a pop art kind of effect which is quite easy to do in photoshop you might have seen many kinds of posters like that for example the entire grand theft auto franchise is based on vector graphics like these so we can maybe talk about them in a later video so if you are new over here hey guys my name is prithviraj and you're watching pr 75k so in this channel i generally upload videos regarding content creation so if that's something that might interest you i would really appreciate if you could hit that subscribe button and also you can check me out on instagram for other fun stuff so yeah let's open adobe photoshop and get started so firstly import your photo and adobe photoshop I'm gonna use this photo of Billie Eilish. To start off, we are gonna remove the background. You can use any tool for that. For this video, I will be using the polygonal lasso tool to get the selection done quickly. You can use the pen tool if you want a more precise and smooth selection. After you are done with the selection, right click, click on select inverse. This will select the background instead of the subject. After that, select your layer and press delete on your keyboard. Now you can create a new layer by pressing this button and drag it below your subject. Take the paint bucket tool or the brush tool and paint the background white in color. Right click on your subject layer and create a duplicate. Select the duplicated layer and uh, click on filter and then hit on filter gallery. From the artistic folder, select the one called poster edges. Just play around with the values to get this gritty kind of look and click on OK. Now go to the image, adjustments and click on threshold. Set the threshold level to about 70 to 75 and hit on OK. Next go to filter, stylize and select on oil paint. Set the stylization to about 5, the cleanliness to about 3 and scale to about 1. Make sure that lighting is unchecked and hit on OK. Now change the blending mode of the layer to color burn. Select the bottom layer and go to filter, blur and Gaussian blur. Change the radius to about 1.6. And go to filter and again add that exact same oil paint effect and hit on OK. Now go to Filter, Filter Gallery and under the Artistic folder, select Cut Out. Set the number of levels to 6, Edge Simplicity to 4 and the Edge Fidelity to about 2. Now decrease the opacity of the top layer a bit. I'm gonna set it to about 57%. Now go to Adjustments tab and select Vibrance. Increase the saturation a bit. I'm gonna set it to about 38%. You know what, let's increase the opacity of the top layer to about 86% to make the effect more prominent. Now press Ctrl or Command on your keyboard and select the two layers. Go to Layers and click on Merge Layers. Now you'll be able to move them as one layer. Let's increase the size to fit the canvas even better. Now select the background layer and fill it to the color you like. I'm gonna use pastel color swatches and select light pink kind of color. Since I used the lasso tool in a hurry, the selection wasn't perfect but we can fix it now. Just gonna crop off this white part. Select the subject layer and hit on delete. And we are basically done. You can make tweaks now, for example I'll be using the level slider to add more contrast to the image. You can download this project of mine as a PSD file as well as other projects from my Patreon page. The link will be given in the description. So as you can see it was kind of simple to get that cartoon or pop art effect on your photos. So you can try that out and see what's working and what's not working. If you have any questions regarding that you can just leave a comment down below. And also you can download this PSD file or the project file from my Patreon page. The link will be in the description. So if this video was helpful I would really appreciate if you could hit that subscribe button for more such videos regarding content creation. And yeah I will catch you guys in the next video real soon. Till then have a great time. Hasta la vista.